this style, I started out with blown out moisturized hair, but you can definitely just use stretched hair too. You want to section the hair into three sections. For the top section, I like to part it so that I get straight lines at the top. You're just parting out your crown here. You just want to take a, a smaller section from the back of your head. You can finger part this out because you're not going to see the parts. start working with the top first. We need to separate it into three sections. You can put the other two sections off to the side and we're going to work with the first section first. Take this section and separate it in half. For this part, I like to use Marley hair to give me some more bulk. My hair is kind of thin and it's not very long, but if you have thicker or longer hair, you should be able to use your hair just fine. If you do choose to use the Marley hair hair, I just pin it right into the middle of the two sections. So once the hair is in, you're going to start flat rolling the hair in a semicircle. Start in the back of your head, work to the front, and then right back to the back. sort of half donut shape which you want to puff up as much as you need and then pin it in place. Don't worry about the Marley hair left out in the back or any strands left out in the back. We're going to use them on the next roll. Now we're going to move on to the next section. We're going to split the section we have here in two and work on section number two. Finger parting here is fine as well. So I'm going to take the Marley hair and work it down to the second section and just kind of roll it in. I'm just pinning the Marley hair down to keep it flat to get ready to start our next roll. Marley 
and roll it into a kind of ball. And I'm going to pin that right in the middle of the third section. flat rolling my hair in around the marley and then I'll puff up the roll to give it more body and height and then you just pin where necessary you can puff your hair to give as much height as you like this is how the top section looks when done Moving on to my middle section, I'm just going to split it in two, once again finger parting. I'm going to work with one side at a time. I use my Eco Styler just to smooth down my edges. And now I'm just going to roll the hair into itself and pin it where necessary. Complete the process again on the opposite side. Once you've pinned your rolls in place, you're going to want to smooth the sides and bobby pin each roll. This will give it a creased look. Now we're going to work with the back section. For an alternate style, you can put some curls in the back and leave it down or off to the side. But for today's style, we're going to roll the back up. Split the back into two sections. Finger parting is fine again. I use Marley hair for this section too. It's hard to see from this angle, but I'm rolling the Marley hair and then rolling my hair around the Marley hair and pinning it into place. When done with section one, just do the same for section two. Smooth and pin any places that need some extra care. And now you have an elegant style that is perfect for formal occasions or for that night out on the town with that special someone this Valentine's Day. for watching and supporting and don't forget to subscribe and like see you next time bye bye